Welcome back to another video. So let's see. Regarding file conversion in Katia v5, I received the following comment. So there is a problem in doing these steps with cat drawings. So when we want to convert some, uh, let's say, newer Katia files to older versions. So I have over here a 2D drawing of a flywheel. And if I will go again to tools, utility, we're going to see that over here I have the possibility to go for the um, compatibility conversion, which will be over here. So downwards compatibility. If I will activate this, we're going to see that at the top we have the convert. And in this case, I want to convert, for example, this file to make it um, again with Katia V5 R18. Over here, I will need to specify the output folder. So in this case, for the output folder, I will go on the desktop and over here I have a test folder. And for document selection, if I will go over here for all, for example, and uh, for this case study, I have uh, downloaded from GrabCAD a flywheel over here. If I will select all the folder over here from downloads, if I will click OK, so let me just go back because I shouldn't have clicked OK. We're going to see that the batch converter will only take um, cut parts and cut assemblies, so it will not work with um, drawings. So let me just do that once again. So over here, this will be the test, the output folder, the file version. And over here, I will go again for all. And um, again, on the download folder, I will select the folder. And we see that initially this uh, file selection was overlapped. And as we can see from the downloads folder, that flywheel part will be selected. But if I will go over here within the same folder, we're going to see that I also have a cat drawing over here, a DXF, and also the cut part. So the main problem with uh, this backwards compatibility is that it only works with um, cut parts and cut assemblies. And as we can see in this case, it will not work with um, 2D drawing. So we also have the possibility over here to do a batch, DXF, IGS and STEP. So this will uh, do that data exchange between Katia and um, DXF. If I will activate this, we're going to see that the output folder, again, I can set that to be the test on my desktop. The output type, we have the possibility to do an output type over here for cut drawing. And as we can see over here for the input, I have the possibility to select the DXF file over here. I can select that. And I can run this and we're going to see that within uh, that test too, we're going to have the output, which will be a cat uh, drawing. So I will run this. We're going to see the batch converter starter starting over here. So let me check that folder, which will be test two on my desktop. And let's see what we're going to have on that. So we're going to have the following file over here. So we're going to say that this will be one uh, megabyte. If I will go within um, this file, we're going to see that the original Katia drawing was a little bit larger. As we can see over here, this will be 1.1 megabytes and this will only be uh, 1.05. So if I will double click this, we're going to see that uh, this drawing will look like this. So I will just do a quick um, check between those two. As we can see, the dimension style is different over here. So we see over here we have a bold font, while within the converted one will be like this. This also because I saved that initially as a DXF. But other than that, we're going to see that we can convert it. But if you want to enable that within an order um, 
file version i'm not sure exactly if you can do that because from what i've seen the um, compatibility utility over here so the downward compatibility will not accept cad drawings so i think that the only solution for 2d drawings is to use an um, universal format like dxf and that will um, will help you to to move that uh, to the drawing from uh, one version to another also if anyone has uh, additional um, input on this please let me know because i'm also curious regarding this as we can see over here within uh, chat gpt we have this uh, batch management but over here there's no batch compatibility and again we cannot do as an input we cannot enable cad drawings at least in in my version of katia so maybe i'm not doing something uh, right over here okay so scooter i hope that uh, you enjoyed this uh, this video also if anyone knows exactly how you can convert a cad drawing please let me in the comment section and i will address this within a following video so that's it thanks for watching